It's upgrade day. Today, we're upgrading all four of these town halls, but before we do, I got a few tips for you guys before you move on to the next town hall level. So let's hop right in and take a look at these accounts and get into our first tip, which is to be 100% maxed. Yes, that does mean all hero levels, all the walls, max that stuff out. Now you can finish the walls while the town hall is upgrading. And maybe if you have like a level on the king or something, finish that while it's upgrading or something in the lab. But I see a lot of people going up with like low level heroes and like a half upgraded base and rushing when really, in my opinion, you should be maxing it out, especially heroes. Heroes are one of the most important parts of the game. If we take a look at all these accounts, Town Hall 11 completely maxed out. The Town Hall 12 completely maxed out. You can see here we got a few hours left on the king. That's not a big deal. We're still going to be upgrading our Town Hall today. The Town Hall 13 completely maxed out. I mean, we got builders on the forge, but they'll be done by the time the Town Hall gets done. No big deal there. And even the Town Hall 14 maxed out. We got all of the walls done. And even the pets, when you get to 14 and higher, you do want to get those pets up because it's just a lot of dark elixir to grind so we got our yak going to level 10 Al and lassie aren't maxed but they don't go up at this level so we don't have to worry about that so we got our last level on our yak everything is good here on the town hall 14. now the one exception to this max rule is going to be your equipment in the blacksmith you don't need to get all of this stuff maxed out before you go to the next town hall level just because it's going to take forever you'll be held up you'll be stuck at town hall 11 forever get your equipment as good as you can do your stuff and get it up as best you can but you don't have to max your equipment before going to the next town hall level and do that as you work through the town hall levels my next tip is to fill up your storages you can see here on the town hall 11 we have full storages but as we start to upgrade this town hall it's going to cost us six million gold we're going to want to replenish that so we could go ahead we could start this town hall upgrade but now we need to go out we need to farm that six million gold that way when the town hall is done we're ready to go on the town hall 12 you can see we were pretty much full we took a defense so we're a little bit lower but that's okay we can fill that up but we're going to go ahead and we're going to upgrade our town hall we got seven and a half days so a week and a half here and we can go ahead and refill that gold now let me know guys which of these accounts should we play gold pass on? I, I've seen some mixed things down there in the comments. Uh, like people saying on the thir the 14 and 15, we should definitely have gold pass. Maybe the lower one, we go free to play. Let me know your guys' thoughts. Should we gold pass all of these accounts or we should we just kind of play them casually? Continuing to move forward, our Town Hall 13, we have 13 and a half days. So we have a little bit of discrepancy here in the time, but that's okay. So when the Town Hall 12 gets upgraded, we'll start on that. We'll start working on that. And as the other Town Halls finish, we'll just start working on those. So let's go ahead and let's start our Town Hall 14, but we need to get that gold up. And I'm saying this because there's a reason. Just, just give me a sec. And finally, our Town Hall 14, it is discounted because we do have the gold pass on this account because I needed to finish the walls. It's going to be 10, uh, 10 days, 19 hours. So actually going to be less than the Town Hall 14, but... If we bought the gold pass on the Town Hall 14, we had the perks, it would reduce that time. So I'm kind of wondering, should we do that and reduce that time right now? Maybe, maybe I just do that just to speed things up. But 10 days, 19 hours. So now we can fill up that gold. And the reason I'm saying to fill that gold up, and I think you should fill it up pretty early on, is because I think the next tip is to save up two star bonuses. When you upgrade a new town hall level, you get a star bonus boost. This will allow you to get a little bit more loot at the beginning of your town hall, and you can actually hold two star bonuses at a time. You get them daily, but you can actually kind of save two up. So I think if we farm up and get all that loot refilled that we just spent upgrading the town halls, then we could save for those star bonus boosts. I think that'll be valuable. And on the same page of saving, if you're able to, and if you're doing wars and doing those few star bonuses, try to save up some loot in the treasury. Again, this is just gonna give you some extra loot to get you going when you get to that new town hall level. So take a little bit of time, go out and hit some farming. Uh, we have a full regular army here on this account, but go out and just fill up those storages while you can oh we don't have a clank a, 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 a seeds machine that'll be all right that'll be all right but uh, this is what i'm going to do with all these accounts is make sure that all the loot is kind of full and topped off before those town hall upgrades are done we are on the town hall 13 i think what we're going to do is we're going to get the gold pass and i kind of want to see that time if it reduces right away if not we'll cancel and go away i'm pretty sure it reduces down 
if it's less. So I kind of want to see that kind of real time here. Uh, but hopefully these tips are helping you guys out. It's nothing official. It's nothing actually major or serious. But these are just little tips that are going to help you out, help you on your journey as you start towards the next town hall level here. Not having a siege machine might actually hurt us a little bit here. Let's hit warden ability uh, just to protect uh, right in through there. Oh boy. Oh boy. We're, we're in a little bit of a pickle here, guys. We're in a little bit of a pickle. We need, we need to kind of work through there. Let's go RC here. We don't have the extra bats. Yeah, I don't know if we're even going to get an extra star on this. Uh, that's okay. Let's just put our bats in here. Uh, it's gonna work in. We'll do what we can. Uh, sometimes that's all you can do. Just do what you can, man. Just do what you can. Let's go ahead and let's uh, hit that. Uh, we'll, we'll get a decent amount of loot on this one, but yeah, I, I didn't realize we didn't have a siege machine. All right, so let's check this out. I'm gonna donate a gold pass from Big Rock. We'll send that over. Oh yeah, that, that's that's really nice. But let's go ahead and let's activate that gold pass. And I kind of want to see this here. Uh, I guess we can fill up our season bank a little bit also, but let's go in here. Let's grab the builder boost, research boost, training boost, and oh, it does it did not go down. Huh. I thought it would go down because of that. I mean, I guess we should have did it before, but if we cancel it, let's see. Yeah, now it's 10 days. So let's go get well, hold on, we might actually I thought it would go down after you got that perk. Eh, interesting. The, the more you know but now we'll just go ahead and we'll do it that way yeah we wasted some gold there but we got to fill it up anyways not a big deal but now we'll have the gold pass but i guess the season's getting ready to end anyways but we can stock up on some of those magic items kind of as we get through here i wasn't really intending to use the gold pass but you know these things happen so now we'll have our town halls kind of more in sync a little bit. So obviously none of this stuff is crazy like, oh, you have to do this or else. And I definitely recommend being maxed. But our final tip for today is going to be have a plan. Now more than ever, it's more important to have a plan when you go up to the next town hall level because you get those extra boosts. You'll get the lab boost. You'll get all those kind of boosts to get you going. So have a plan when you go up. Get your progress base ready and just be ready to go when that town hall does finish now what we're going to do is as all these town halls finishing we're going to go ahead and we'll do individual priority guides for each town hall level so 12 13 14 and 15 and then we'll start merging this into like a four in one let's play series so you can kind of expect the town hall 12 guide to be out in what five days the town hall 12 guide or 13 guide to be out in like eight days or so give or take and then the 14 and 15 will be a few days after that so something to kind of plan on there so you guys can look forward to it but again these are just some tips to help you get going let me know if these were helpful and let me know if there's any subjects that you guys need specifically covered as we go up to these new town hall levels i'm really excited for this new series i'm really excited to kind of merge these four into one series that four and one let's play i think it'll be really fun hope you guys are ready for it as well if you are don't forget to leave a like subscribe you guys have a great day keep on clash bashing